Hey guys, it's Jeff with Hunting Rocks. I'm out here at Haunted Ridge Rocks, and today I am with Dustin Fines Rocks. He's back What's over up? here. He just found himself a really nice piece. I'll give you a little view of it, but uh, you'll have to check out his video and see what all he found. Anyhow, we're about to hunt some rocks. We're going to find some really nice Drew's Quartz and a whole bunch of other stuff. So I hope you enjoy the video. Look at that. That was just sitting here. So we're gonna come back and get some good stuff here. It's rained a little bit since the uh, big dig event with Brian Major here. All right guys, let me tell you one of the reasons why I love this place so much. I just saw this Drew's right here. Let's pull it off the ground, see what we have. Well, he's not very big, but Look at the sparkle on that. Little muddy. It's all right, that'll wash off. It just glistens. It's an overcast day today, so I don't have much sunshine. Give you an idea of, of just how pretty that is. All right, guys, if you remember my very, very first video, I was out here during a large get-together they had. A whole bunch of... Other famous YouTubers were out here, besides Dustin. There was uh, Brian the Crystal Collector. There was the camping couple. And this is one of the dig pits that they did to uh, get down in the ground, see what other things they may have. And while I was down here, I looked over and I saw this massive plate of agate. Let me zoom in there on that. That is just beautiful. There's a little Drews on the side here. I don't think I'll be getting that out of the ground today. But if agate is something you're into, this is another great place to come. Sounds like Dustin's found himself something good over there. Dude, check this out. He's just sitting here. Walk over there and take a look. We have got so little rain, and so many people have been out here, and that was just sitting there right on the surface, just like that. The little bit of rain that we had took the clay off. Look at that thing. That's cool. Man, that is very cool. It's going to have some cool agate, too, on the sides. Oh, yeah. Well, we just saw Dustin's cool find. Let me see what I can do. I'm telling you folks, it's out here. It is everywhere out here. Here's my gloves. This is a piece. Look at this guy. Woo, so sparkly and pretty. Got a really nice bump up on the top. Oh, I'm losing it there. There we go. Just phenomenal stuff. It's everywhere out here. If you step on a rock out here, there's a high probability that you're gonna be stepping on Druzy, you're gonna be stepping on agate, limonite, uh, hematite. There's so much stuff out here. You can just see the iron content of this soil, this clay around here. So much cool stuff out here. This area we are in is just pulling out the pretty pieces of Drew's quartz. There yes, are sir. some really nice. Oh, look at that. Look what Dustin just found. That's beautiful. It's a little red now, but that's just the clay and the dirt on it. Whenever I get home, this will get a get a little bit of a power wash and then I'll either soak it in some iron out or my favorite, the muriatic acid. A lot of people aren't big fans of muriatic acid because it can turn your crystals yellow. And if you're a slacker like me, it will. <laughs> and yes, I've done that quite a bit myself. You, uh, you just gotta remember to not leave it in for too terribly long. All right guys, Dustin's digging himself out of. I don't know, this might be good Him. or it may just be a rock. It could, be, could very well be a heartbreaker, but check yeah. this out. Right here we have a nice little piece of barite. Yeah. 
It's tiny. It's really cool. Yeah. There's all sorts of neat minerals to find out here. Hematite, barite, of course the Druzy's everywhere. Look at this one here. It's it's weathered, but it's kind of neat. I'll find a use for that. I like it. It's going in my it's going in the bucket. You gotta be careful out here because there's so much neat stuff. Oh, oh he's almost got it, folks. Okay. Um I don't think I want to mess with it anymore like that. Okay. Um well, I tell you I what. I think I just dinged a couple crystals, but that's okay. Let's let's flip this over. Well, guys, check out Dustin's video, but or this might never have good reveals. <laughs> with this big old heartbreaker, we finally got it up. It is a massive chunk of agate, but this is what we were going after. Yeah, that is pretty much this all here. solid agate, which is still pretty insane. Oh yeah, we were hoping for. We were hoping for a super spiky Druze, but instead we get a monster agate with a little bit of spiky Druze. We'll find it. Oh yeah. It's here. So Dustin just found a really cool piece here. A little seam piece. A little seam piece. It's got some chert going on with it. Some of the Druzy. Too much caffeine, not enough food. <laughs> what do you think that is up on top there? Um, I'm not sure. Like uh, epimorphs of the dolomite crystals maybe? Yeah. And then look at the coloration. Let me let me zoom in. Hopefully, I don't make you sick doing that. I'm holding but, as still as I can. Yeah, that is really <laughs> cool. And then this piece I found down here. Well, he was finding that. I got this one that's covered in the Chalcedony. And a lot of people have asked me, you know, how how do I get Chalcedony off of my rocks? Well, here's no. the thing: you can't. It's made this that covers the quartz. It's the same exact material, folks. Yeah. That is silicon dioxide, SiO2. So anything that will get rid of that will destroy your quartz. And the only way you're going to do that with probably is with probably aqua regio, which will destroy gold. So that's something. It's a pretty piece. I like it. I'm keeping it as it is. A lot of people don't like these because they're not the pretty beautiful crystal like you kind of get with this piece. It's a little dirty, little tiny guy. But this is a very beautiful bitroidal piece. This is going in my bucket. All right guys, whenever you're out here at Haunted Ridge, you got to keep an eye on the ground. Look at this piece of Drew's here. It's got scuffs on it. People have just stepped on that. You got to yeah. keep your eyes down. Yep, that's just from being stepped on. And I think that's a big, look, look at that. Oh, that's a look beautiful that. plate. That's going to be a big, nice plate. I think. Oh, man, this camera thing is in my way. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I'm doomed. <laughs> this is Dustin's last video as he chokes to death with his camera. <laughs> I think that's going to be worth taking. Oh yeah. I mean, I guess in theory we could rinse it off in the pond. That's here, but... that's what I'm going to do. I'm yeah, going to pop this Missouri piece clay out. Missouri is so thick. I don't know. Oh yeah, you can tell. Look. That's oh all. yeah. That's it's all crystals. And it would be perfect if people were paying attention and picked it up and didn't step on it right here. Yep. Like that's gonna be a big, nice spotroidal plate. And it's not just stepping on it that'll ruin it. What happens is, is while you're out here, your feet get muddy. Yep. You get rocks in there and it will scratch it up. And the rocks you get and your, the mud on your feet here are quartz. Yep. So the quartz definitely scratches quartz. Oh look, here's another one right next to it. Some bar. Oh, wow. It's a nice piece. Here we go. I got some of that mud off. This mud here is like peanut butter. It sticks to the, hopefully not the roof of your mouth, but the bottom of your shoe. Yeah. I haven't tried eating any. <laughs> it's, I wouldn't recommend it. I fell down once out here. It doesn't taste that good. Well, well, now that you mention it, I have gotten it into my mouth probably a few times being overzealous digging for things. That has probably actually happened. Another really pretty piece. This is a small one, but again, you can see the scuff marks on it. So talking about this clay and how sticky it is. Yeah, so yeah, I, I found this big cool piece, right? I'm, I'm going to wash it off in the lake here and <laughs> it's just... 
<laughs> like look at look at that. <laughs> you you that's why you have to have a pressure washer. It's also why uh, I don't really bring a spray bottle with me out here. As you can see, it's a kind of a lost cause. This is going to be a cool piece, though. That will be a cool piece. The ducks are checking us out, seeing what we're doing. <laughs> if you ducks know where any good crystal is, could you please point me to it? Quack everywhere. <laughs> That's what I thought. <laughs> yeah, check this one out. Yeah. Man, I love the, I love the Boitroidals on them. So, for those of you that don't know, Boitroidal, it's a Greek word. It comes from Greek. It's a Greek language. And it means grapes because it resembles a cluster of grapes yep it resembles a cluster of grapes and you'll find betroidal in everything whether it be quartz hematite just grabbed a couple nice pieces here this guy's a little broke up but it's not horrible you know it's, i can work with that polish up that agate that's some beautiful betroidal right there betroidal jersey and then over here there's this little piece I'll probably turn that into a necklace or something. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Just found that one with some uh, laminate on it. But the one I found interesting wasn't there. But it's right here. The only way I spotted it was those little points sticking out. But that is a really neat piece. Once I get that uh, cleaned up, I'll show you at the end of the video today. Dustin and I decided to make our way down this path here. We're walking along, just shooting the breeze. And I look over and go, Dustin, look what I found. And he goes, are you talking about what I found? He's over there. I spotted this one over here. And I said, no, not that one. That's beautiful. I don't know. I don't know which one's better. I don't know. Good, man. I like yours. Yours is really pretty. I found this one though church pipe organ I mean they're just those little stalagmites of druzy are all over that this piece here covered in limonite oh yeah these are some of the prettiest pieces that I've seen today we found some other really pretty ones but these these excite me folks those are my favorite right there that's a good find it's a little bit chillier today than it was yesterday when I was out at Honan Bridge. Um, yesterday it was about 70 degrees. Today it's right around 40 degrees Fahrenheit. So doing the pressure washing in my big waterproof coat. Hopefully I don't catch pneumonia. Anyhow, let's get to this, see what I get. Well guys, I was going to show you me power washing the Druzy Quartz, but the power washer was a little loud, a little annoying and I didn't think you wanted to see that. So here's some of the Druzy Quartz I cleaned up. Um, I do hope you enjoyed the video today. I hope I can get a like, share, and subscribe from you. And also, please check in the description for a link to a Haunted Ridge Rocks um, Facebook page, so in case you decide to go there yourself, and also a link to Dustin Finds Rocks. Anyhow, thank you for watching, and I hope to see you on the next uh, time I'm out hunting rocks.